Looking for a new kind of superhero show? One that shows what happens when superheroes are as dirty as the crime they fight and abuse their powers behind closed doors? Well, the boys on Amazon is for you. And if you need to know what happens in season one to prep for season two, and you've only got three minutes, well, this video is for you too. Before we talk about the boys, let's talk about the seven. They're kind of like the Justice League, except when no one's looking, they're real bunch of assholes. Pardon my French, f those f there's Homelander, The Deep, Queen Maeve, Black Noir, A-Train, and Translucent. The seven are owned by the corrupt Vaughn International and managed mostly by VP Madeline, still well played by evil Elizabeth Shue, which still feels wrong. In the first episode, the seven are joined by their newest recruit, Starlight, who's actually a nice person and, like everyone else, believes the seven are good guys. But they're not good guys. Huey Campbell learns this the hard way when A-Train plows through his girlfriend Robin like, you guessed it, A-Train. Robin? Huey's offered a settlement to stay hush-hush, but he doesn't take it, and the next day he meets Billy Butcher, who claims to be with the FBI and wants to bring down the seven. Spoiler alert, he's not FBI. So look, technically I'm not a fed. What? He runs a ragtag group of vigilantes called The Boys that includes Frenchie and Mother's Milk. Which is honestly what Homelander should have been called, because it turns out he's a bit of a mama's boy. On her first night, Starlight learns to never meet your heroes because the deep is a creep. The mayor of Baltimore tries to lowball a deal with Vaught because he knows some dirty secrets. Bad move, mayor of Baltimore. Meanwhile, Billy convinces Huey to sign the NDA and plant a bug, but Translucent sees this and follows Huey. They electrocute and kidnap Translucent, but his skin is impenetrable, so how do they hurt him? Shove a bomb up where the sun shines all the time, because he's invisible. Get it? There are so many crazy things about what you just said. Never mind. Pop goes translucent. Speaking of pop, meet Popclaw, A-Train's D-list superhero girlfriend. The boys spy on her and find out about a drug called Compound V, which is basically like steroids for soups. About the same time, Huey has met Starlight and she's relieved to be hanging out with a normal guy, but has no idea that Huey's behind the disappearance of Translucent. The boys continue to spy on Popclaw and watch her kill her landlord and A-Train kill her. What a mess. Literally. Can't show you how nasty this is. <laughs> Looking for Compound V, they uncover the female who's basically like feral girl Wolverine. Fought's trying to get the soups into the military, the politicians say no, so they blackmail them. A plane gets hijacked over international waters, and this is a great PR opportunity for the Seven to save some lives, but Homelander wrecks the cockpit with his laser eyes and decides to let everyone die instead. The Deep is trying to be better, so he rescues a dolphin from SeaWorld, but doesn't make the dolphin wear a seatbelt. So he gets demoted from the Seven and shaves his head like Britney. Huey learns from a stretchy hypocrite preacher that Compound V is being given to babies and this is how soups are created. Thanks to Haley Joel Osment, a former child star who can read minds, the boys learn about Kamiko's backstory and the Vought plans to create superpowered terrorists so the soups have someone to fight. Holy sh Homelander finds out about the boys, tells Starlight about Huey, the boys get captured, and Starlight saves the day. A-Train tries to stop her, but all that super juice makes him have a heart attack. Meanwhile, Homelander burns a hole through Madeline's head, and we learn that Billy hates Homelander because he thinks that Homelander killed his wife eight years ago, but instead, it turns out she had an affair with Homelander and died giving birth to Homelander's baby. Plot twist, she didn't die. She's been secretly raising Homelander's baby, and now you're ready for season two. 